Hey everybody, how's it going? I um, wanna wish you guys a happy, happy, happy Valentine's Day to all you uh, lovebirds out there. <laughs> and if no one told you they love you today, I'm gonna tell you I love you today. So today was a good day. I had the um, high demand love pop up shop event today it was it was real nice. Um, a lot of nice vendors. It was a wonderful, wonderful event. Uh, it was on 63rd, 6345 Southwestern. Uh, it's a nice establishment that you can rent out, so look out for that. Uh, I didn't even meet the owners of it. I don't know if they were there or not, but that's a place if you wanna do events in, make sure you look those guys up. And I just had a good time. I wanna do an unboxing of the stuff I bought uh, there. So let's start off with uh, Little Squeeze. Now you have to excuse me, Little Squeeze. Young gentlemen, this lemonade. I was at one other event. I have two bottles. I bought one for me, one for the kids, and I I, I drunk both of them. Sorry, sorry, kids. <laughs> but they were so good. But little squeeze, this young gentleman, man, this is some good. This is heaven in a bottle. This is very good. It's nutritious. I got like a fruit punch with berries on top. I I drunk it while I ate. Uh, so look out for little little squeeze. Great lemonades. They're, they're wonderful, wonderful. And do tell. It was their event and I had their uh, steak tacos. I'm sorry, I, I ate those there too. Those those things are amazing, amazing. I usually wait till the end of the events to eat because I'll get sleepy, but I, I couldn't help because it. it was smelling so good. So we had steak, chicken, and shrimp tacos, which was amazing. Um, I had the steak. I usually don't eat too much steak, but I, I had you know to, to try that out. It was very good. Uh, so shouts out to Dutail. Plus I love those guys. Um, uh, they are meant to be amazing. Uh, I support them as well. They support the swanky movement. So, shouts out to them, the detail. Let's open up my little goodies I got right here for Valentine's Day since I guess I'm celebrating Valentine's with you guys <laughs> and myself. So, let's see. Okay, so here go one of the items I bought too. This was cool. The young lady is Miss Scope. And she sells the, I hope I'm saying it right. She's gonna probably kill me not saying it right. But Miss Scope, she has the, uh, she had the glasses on. I follow on Instagram. I know she had these, these here, which is kind of fashionable. It's kind of cool, you know, it's like, cause you know, I had the kind, this kind is irritating my eyes and face, but this is cool here, you know, it's like, it's kind of cool, you know, and it's, it covers everything. Very good, very good, high quality sturdy. This is the young lady here. She has those toners for those ladies to get the hips. And, all the good thighs and stuff in, in order. And uh, the only thing I, this is the only thing I can get from them. <laughs> so, <laughs> is the the, uh, the, the the protector for the guy here. So, we have a beautiful couple. They have the dynamite dip. Check it out, dynamite. Husband and wife, the husband, me and him is real cool. I love the guy, he bought a couple of swanky shirts. Um, their dip is uh, called Candy's Dynamite Dip and it comes in chicken, uh, shrimp, and chicken, shrimp, and turkey, I believe, yeah. Uh, uh, it's, it's very good, very good. Uh, check out Candy's Dynamite Dip and you know, for you, you, you healthy nutrition people, this is where it's at, like you wanna eat good and don't feel guilty, this is it's right here and I, I um, I kind of eat healthy, not by force or for any reason, just that I eat more healthy now because of my taste bud have changed. You know, when your mind changes, your, your taste bud changes. This is pleasure right here without having to guilt. So look out for a dynamite dip. Got the dip, good stuff, very good stuff. Nice couple too, oh, they, they, they love you. I, I love those guys. Then I got my pickles now. These pickles here, it's off the chain. So I had to get two bottles because the last time I was with the kids, so I couldn't get the one I really wanted because you know, it's with the kids. You know, sometimes you gotta do things with the kids. So I got the kids the sour, the sour pickles. I don't know if you can see that. And it's called one of pickles. And these are the sour pickles. Oh, and this is the sour regular, the regular sour. Oh, this is very good, I'm talking about addictive. It's actually um, like if you have like a little event or something, or you have some guests over at the house, you put some of this out. Very good, very good. And I also got the Hurricane 
Warner Pickles Hurricane. And a hurricane here, it's got some tequila in here. So this is for me. <laughs> so when I was the kid last, with the kids last time, I didn't get this because, you know, they couldn't drink it. So I got me some, some hurricane pickles. So I'm, I'm down to try this. Maybe I'll try some of this today. It's no school tomorrow, so I don't have to get up early for homeschool and all that good stuff and learning things. So maybe I'll have a couple of these tonight. So that's, that, that's we'll see. That's the uh, Wanna Pickles Hurricane. And this is the Gourmet Premium product. Yeah. So this is very nice. Check them out. And then I get this here. Now this is Jettable. So yeah, you see that little leaf on it, that means it has some of that stuff in there. So I don't indulge in that stuff. People know me personally, I don't, it's not my thing. You know, it's, it's, this doesn't match with my, not my character, but just my mind. It's like, no, it don't matter. Try it, you know, you know, you try it younger, you try it, you know, retry it, you, you, you remember like, that ain't your thing. So I bought one of these here. This is uh, Sangria. It's infused with, I don't even know how, where is the, um, with cannabis. Uh, Jettables, make sure y'all look out for Jettables. Uh, Jettables, edibles, the young lady had um, candies and everything, real nice. Like I said, I don't indulge in it, uh, cause my mind is, you know, you know, it just don't, my mind don't calculate right, just, it just don't, what's for this here. So I bought a bottle anyway, just to put my wine collection, just in case somebody I know wanna, you know, have some. And I can introduce this to them, you know, and then, you know, get, I got to support and, you know, I like to drink a little bit here and there. And I thought it was interesting. And I also, it's a, for me, it's like a um, good conversation piece, you know, with sangria, you know, with sangria, you cut some fresh fruit, put it in some sangria. Oh, that's always beautiful. That's how I drink it. So to have this infused, you know, to introduce this to someone, it's, this is a beautiful thing. So this is good for my, uh, my wine collection is called Jettables. And this, these two young, beautiful ladies, they were right side by me at the uh, event and uh, wonderful people. So check it out, Jettables, Edibles. And uh, last but not least, and uh, I got my, uh, out of my kitchen. I know y'all, I know y'all know that I posted a lot. Yeah, oh man, her cakes are marvelous. They get me in trouble because I just can't eat one piece. And I'll just be like, oh, overindulging it, and I know I shouldn't, but it just be so good. And this is the pineapple cake here, which I want to try because I love pineapple. So I'm really, I'm gonna try some of this tonight. I'm, I'm gonna get some of this tonight. I wish I could have it with the wine, which that do sound good, but I might have to get the regular sangria wine and with the piece of cake, you know, and and, and, and go from there. But yeah, uh, shouts out to the guy, um, FYO Service Creation. He had the alcohol slushy, so the alcohol slushy was nice. He had one with Hennessy, Hennessy, and one with Crown Royal, Apple Crown Royal. Now you know it's cold outside, so I'm like, I'm not gonna get a slushy. You know, it's cold, and um, you know why would you, you know, do that? So I said I'm getting kind of. I was in, inside the place too as well, so I like it was a little cold in there because I was by the door. The doors going open up back and forth. So as I was coming in and out, the young brother was like, you know, trash. So I was like, yeah, let me try it. So I took a sip. I was like, oh, this is good stuff. Too bad it's not summertime. But I'm like, you know what? Let me man up. You know, man up. You know, support the young brother and uh, have an alcoholic slushy. You know, stop being so, you know, I'm so tight wide when it comes to business. So I got the alcohol slushy. Now, for some strange reason, it was a weird thing that I started getting warm. So <laughs> apparently he posed very good. And uh, I like I liked, I liked the style because he was saying like, you know, you, you buy one for a certain amount and then you buy another one for another additional amount. It's unlimited drink. And I'm like, oh wow, we <laughs> this is beautiful. I said, just give me the, the regular one for one, the, the one. So, but the slushy was very good, very good. Uh, made me feel good, warmed me up, you know. And that was a good thing and loosened me up some too. So that was good. Uh, shout out to the young young brother. And like I said, it's FYO Service Creation and he sells alcohol slushies. Love it, it was good. And another shout out to the Vixen young lady, Vixen Novelty, uh, nice sister. Um, it's a couple of more people. I, I didn't get their name and I didn't get their cars. I'm so, I wanna apologize to you guys. 
um, the Vixen, the young lady Vixen, uh, she has Vixen, Vixen Novelty Boutique and she has adult toys and um, she had books and games and stuff like that. So you can check her out too as well. I didn't buy nothing because I don't have nobody to do the games with. And then she said she had things for guys solo too. And I was like, okay, <laughs> I'm not pre 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 prepared for that. Uh, so I was like, nah, I'm okay, young lady. I wish I could support. So shout out to her too. So check her out, Vixen Novelty Boutique. And she has a, adult toys, games and everything, real nice. So it was, like I said, it was other vendors there. I'm sorry to get some in there because it was other vendors that bought things for me. I don't even try to find the cards. I don't know what I did with the cards. I can't remember I can't remember the face and the name of the, the vendors, but it was, it was a real nice event. I'm happy. Swanky, myself, clothing brand was there. I did good. Pretty good. Um, this is my first time selling out, not the whole entire of uh, the, the goods, but I had uh, I sold out some of the, the, the hoodies, uh, medium size. Um, the support is, is beautiful. Some of my uh, my uh, peoples came, showed some love. It was good seeing them. Um, shouts out to them. Um, I just had a beautiful time, wonderful time, like always. And once again, it was a do-tell event. The concept of sticking together is amazing, which is what I preach. That's what swanky positive is all about. Being swanky means being disciplined, positive, while having fun. But it, you know, you also want to unite and uh, we want to bring people together. And we want to show that our culture can unify with each other. You know, we can't hate on each other, can't knock the next man because what they doing, you know, let's support each other. You know, even if you feel like, you know, like say if somebody's selling something high priced, of our culture, still buy it, you know, support that person. It's nothing wrong with that. Support is support is support. You know, if somebody has something lower class and you think, well, I'm too good to spend this on that. Well, spend what you think is what you want to give them. If you see some for $10 and you think you're too, too high class to spend $10, give them a $20. I'm quite sure they'll like that. So we just got to support each other, have each other back. And I think now is the time for us to stick together and show and prove that uh, our culture is it's very strong and very powerful. We just got to realize it ourselves. So I want to be long-winded. You know, I get to talk about positive and all that stuff. I get crazy. But I want to thank you guys uh, once again for the support. Swanky, I want to thank you guys for the support. I appreciate you guys a, a thousand percent. And um, make sure you guys look out for the next um, venue that we're going to have. Uh, I got to find out what's the next one is going to be uh, for next. I try to do one every month for now. So I gotta find out when the next one's gonna be next month. Um, and then I'm gonna just expand and grow. So I wanna thank you guys and happy Valentine's again to you ladies and gents, couples, married, single, everybody, happy Valentine's Day. I wish you guys a blessed one. And uh, I'll talk to you guys later.